So in this video, I'm going to talk about step by step. I give you a full plan. I will show you each and everything on a screen, like how to start on eBay. If you are on a budget or you have no money whatsoever, I've been selling on eBay and Amazon from past 11 years, and I am a full time seller. I started with very less money, like little to no money, 35 pound. That was the first money which I spent on a first product. I just used to buy the stuff from the local shop like Poundland as the I will show you that in this particular video as well please watch this video all the way through because this is going to be super important for you please don't forget to hit the like and subscribe i'm not just saying it just hit the like and subscribe that will be a massive help let's get started with step one so in a step one once you create an account a lot of people they make this mistake that they start listing the item straight away what you need to do first of all is to be in a good books of ebay that's what i call it because if you're gonna start listing Listing the item straight away, eBay just becomes suspicious and they actually can ban your account as well. So that's why I see a lot of time in the YouTube comments that people are saying, Oh, my account was suspended, that happened, this and that. You need to actually build a little bit of feedback before you start listing on eBay. Now, the question is how you can actually build that feedback. So, building a feedback, it's really, really great because it's gonna work as a social proof as well. Because once you create an eBay, eBay ID in front of your ID, it actually shows how much feedback you have. So the more you have, the more social proof you have. But it doesn't take into consideration, this is like a loophole in the system, that you have that feedback as a buyer or you have that feedback as a seller. So I recommend get a feedback as a buyer, at least five, you can buy very cheap item. Like there are many 99p item, one pound item, two pound item, or you might need something that you can buy from eBay. You can and buy that and build at least five feedback within two weeks like try to wait at least two weeks before you list your first item i know we get excited as soon as we create our account we want to list something but this is something for a longer period of time it can actually hurt you most of the people and i know this is not the point where you are thinking about making money i know we all just get into rush and we gonna make money as soon as possible we're gonna go to that becoming a full time eventually but first look what you can sell around your house because eBay love when you actually sell used item as well so if you just go open your drawer you might have some you know mobile phone and accessories like a cable or old TV remote or something one man junk is a other man treasure I, I didn't mean it that way so I mean to say that you might not need something and it can be very valuable for another person I had many cloths and I still if I don't use some Thing, I still sell that on eBay. Like even though my account is like making over thirty thousand pound every single month, I still list the used cloths on my store as well. On eBay, it doesn't really matter like what niche you are in, like how many time you buy on eBay, and uh, actually you as a buyer go into a seller store and see what other item they are selling. So you don't need to think about niche. Like in the beginning, please just list all the item that you have inside your house. You're gonna make some money out of it, and in the exchange of that you're gonna get a feedback so this is in the first step you are just trying to make yourself familiar with how to actually process an order on ebay how the postage is working all that kind of stuff as well but you can actually go to your local shop this is how i started in a stage two as well and i'm telling you each and everything the way i did you can go to the shops like argos poundland asda and i'm gonna show you a couple of examples right here so for example, this item right here, which is a, a WD-40, this is only one pound on a Poundland website. You can see that right here. And if I quickly go on eBay, the same item, what they are doing, they are bundling them together. So if you bundle them together, it's still going to cost you same money to post the item as well, but you are making more profit. So this person right here is selling them for 12 65 and you can ship this for little as three pound with Hermes as well. So it the, sh the shipment for that is not expensive. They have sold 41 of them so far. Whenever you need to calculate the profit, like how much profit you will be making, you can actually use this free tool called eBay Fee Calculator. So if you go to the eBay Fee Calculator, what I normally like to use this one is called Final Value. You will see this link right here. It's called FinalFeeCalculation.co.uk. And this is almost up to date. So if we calculate this one, 
they are selling this one for 12.65 so selling price is 12 pound and 65 pence and the shipping charge they are paying three pound let put three pound and ten pence with the Hermes. it is like you can ship all of them with that and then uh, shipping uh, uh, cost so we're gonna put in a shipping cost shipping charge to the buyer we are offering free shipping and the item cost is five pound and they are making two pound and 63 profit and you might think oh this is only two pound and 63 but imagine you if you are just selling like this is only one item you're only selling five of them like this person have sold 41 of them so they're 41 sold it have made a total profit of nearly 100 pound in this case right here so don't underestimate the small profit sometime this is a lot of people think about okay well you know it's gonna be this is gonna be a lot of work it this is the way in the beginning once you're just gonna start out but obviously slowly slowly you can actually scale your business and there are many other retailers you can use as well i have done many videos how to find the products from them as well i'm gonna link a couple of them inside the description just check the description and a pin comment you will see how to work with like as the argos i have done many videos about them but moving on to stage number three now what you can do in a stage number three now you in a stage number three you can start drop shipping so in a drop shipping there are many local suppliers like a UK based suppliers UK e drop shipping suppliers on eBay you can use them and uh, they will actually do the all the fulfillment they have a lot a lot of products for you to actually list on eBay so I'm gonna give you a couple of examples the one which works really really well for me as well so for example this is the one which called sales e right here so if you come to the sales e website but you can normally do you can actually actually just click right here and click on their UK warehouse so inside their UK warehouse they will be able to show you what products they have so like you know these chairs and uh, like like for example these types of gaming chair if you just simply go on eBay you will see people are selling it for nearly like 150 200 so they are only selling it for 55 pound right here so you can take the items from here copy the title each and everything and you can list them on to your ebay store so whenever the buyer placed the order on your ebay store you can just simply come here and you can place the order for the customer so the way the sales e and the, the other supplier which i'm going to tell you why i actually recommend these supplier because they are properly drop shipping supplier like they don't include the invoices they know that you are actually doing drop shipping so it is actually allowed to use these suppliers on ebay as well because ebay do allow you to use some sort of fulfillment center so this comes under that terms and condition so you are perfectly able to use these suppliers as well the other one so before we talk about a second supplier it is very important to actually register your business thanks to the sponsor of this video today awesome they can help you register your business and it's only gonna cost you 12 pound if you go there and register your business by yourself you're gonna do all the work and you're gonna pay the 12 pound as well so why not just pay 12 pound to awesome and they can do each and everything for you i'm gonna leave the link for them inside the description thank you so much for sponsoring this video let's get back to the second supplier which i use a lot is called cj drop shipping so cj drop shipping is actually have way more functions when it comes to drop shipping because CJ can actually work as a drop shipping tool as well. So for example, I can let me change the currency right here into Great British Pound and we can confirm it. And I can same like sales -y, I can come right here and click on Britain Warehouse. But what different you can do with CJ is that you can actually link your eBay store with CJ drop shipping. So once you create an account, you can simply link your store. I'm gonna leave a couple of videos for that inside the description as well, which will Will show you how to do it but with once you link the store you can just actually click once and they can just simply list the item for you it is completely free to use it a lot of drop shipping tool there is a subscription that you need to pay for it but with the cj drop shipping like they have all the products and they actually let you list these products for free as well so cj drop shipping 
is actually a great supplier when it comes to working with them so this is the way you can actually what i call it in a stage three you can start with the drop shipping after the, the retail arbitrage so in a stage number four what you want to do in a stage number four is to invest the money that you are making from a drop shipping and a retail arbitrage because don't always stick to one business model you need to make like a multiple business models like you're doing drop shipping you're doing retail arbitrage you're selling the stuff which you don't need as well and at the same time you are working with a different supplier so for example sales cj drop shipping and what you want to do invest the money back in a business and in the fourth you can actually buy some physical stuff from china you don't need to like for example do the packing and shipping there are fulfillment companies which can store the stuff for you and they can do the packing and shipping so for example the one which i use is called hubbo so once you buy something from china which i'm going to give you a couple of example you can just simply send it to them and they will do storing packing and shipping so this is the way you can actually scale the business the way i do but at the end of day you're gonna have to really start the business from somewhere so once you go on a website like for example you don't need to go directly on alibaba and buy like a hundred and two hundred or three hundred units as well so for example right here on uh, aliexpress you can see this item if we can even start start with a small quantity this only costs 23 dollars so let's say with the shipping like it's a free shipping but let's say put the tax on the top you have 25 dollars to pay for this one and this one is being sold for 36 dollars like you i i put the currency in dollars but you can obviously change it into the pound as well uh the next one right here like for example let's say we buy this uh, sports bras so this one gonna cost 270 let's say with the this is this is uh, with the shipping it's gonna cost around let's say 350 so with the 350 there are many many different colors as well but if we go right here these ones are selling like almost a double price and the postage for these ones is, is really really cheap you can bundle them together you can sell many different colors as well so for example skin right here we go to excel it this is being sold for like 930 so imagine you buy this one for little as 350 and you sell it for 930 right here and they also offer it's a free shipping right here you don't always have to buy in bulk there are many items you can buy like maybe just only the quantity of 10 you can message the seller on uh, aliexpress and you can say okay well i want to buy 10 of them can you give me some discount and like nine out of ten time they will ob obviously offer a discount because they are bundling the postage together so it costs them cheaper to ship the items together as well so this is in a fourth stage where you can actually scale the business and take it from there as well so i have been selling on ebay and amazon from past 11 years like even if i go on holidays and even if i'm away from my workplace i'm still making money like i'm sitting in a toilet i'm still making money these are the perks of business which you don't get to do once you have a job at the end all the 11 years of experience i combined into one system and i created this zero to full-time ebay selling system a lot of testimonials you will be able to read them right here on my website you can see and uh, this is have to be on my official website this is the course page right here you can read all the details what you're gonna learn each and everything so if you really want to kind of jump start your journey and learn from somebody who been there done that you want to understand what to do how to do exactly what products to sell what suppliers to work with how to actually create this whole business i have a complete system right on my web website so i'm gonna leave the link for that inside the description make sure you check that out and i'm gonna put one video right here which gonna be about uh, cj drop shipping so this is a supplier which i mentioned inside the video that video gonna be right here it's gonna show you how to work with the cj drop shipping in the detail so check this one